How's the view on your monitor? Looking good. The scenery's a little bland, though. All right. Let's proceed with functionality testing. We're starting with electro-optical targeting systems calibration. Sam, I'm going to display a virtual target. Try to follow it visually. If things seem backwards, let me know and I'll adjust the optical nerve sensors. You know, this is a real pain in the ass. How many times are you guys gonna make me do this? It's important we have baselines, Gideon. Just because you can read a manual doesn't mean you know what you're doing. True. You know I know what I'm doing, so let's do something different. What's on today's test schedule? Look, I know you're in a rush to get to the bar, but we've got a lot to go over. Passing full control to you now. Go ahead and give us some basic rotational movement readings. Actuators functioning nominally. We're going to get readings on boost limitation. Engage whenever you want. Overheating. That's maximum practical output on our current reactor design. The suit's cooling system can't keep up with that output level. It's causing some temporary performance loss, especially in the skeletal actuators. I'm losing like 30% mobility here. 30% is within our project goals. Elena, let's move on before Frank reads us the project grant, chapter and verse. Firing systems. Proceed with test. Affirmative. Launching virtual target. We're going to adjust target acquisition. Recoil compensators are on and functioning normally. You can't suppress the recoil anymore? <sighs> Sam, your weapon isn't exactly stock. I know. I'm changing blade modes. Let's try firing something different. We're still working on expanding the number of configurations stored in memory. You can't just scan whatever you want and have it work. That being said, go ahead and activate the scanner. This thing is even picking up surface scratches. Blade can only replicate what already exists, 
Even the imperfections. Now we're going to check the grenade mounts. on how far we can push the actuators. I'm releasing an object to test your impact force. Our friends at the Pentagon were happy to lend us a brand new piece of equipment. Electromagnetic armor. Punch it as much as you'd like, Sam. Confirming electromagnetic reaction. Sam, give the electromagnetic engine generating the reaction force a second to cool. So we can't hit the thing too quick, huh? Go ahead and punch it again. Nothing beats the old one, too. <laughs> Looks like you've still got some bite in you, Sam. measurements we made of your brain's sympathetic nervous system and tune the R's suit synaptic emitters to augment your reactions under fire. Doesn't really make walking around with electrodes all day any more comfortable. Small price to pay for having elevated synaptic activity during critical fight or flight situations. Will you two quit bickering like a couple of MIT grad students? Now let's proceed with our test of the R's functionality. Let me know when you're ready, Sam. Okay. I finished implementing the manual trigger system you asked for. The system will automatically lock if it detects any life-threatening imbalances in your hormonal levels due to extended use. I think that's enough for today's test. Good job, Sam. That little workout made me hungry. Elena, you up for some luckies?